Hello, this is Mr. Nesker. Uh, today I'm going to be reviewing the WinX DVD Ripper Platinum. And uh, I have used this program. Um, I have looked at it pretty in-depthly. Uh, one of the main reasons why I got this program is because I wanted to use the um, DVD ripping feature to MP4 because I wanted to put some, uh, some movies onto my Amazon Kindle Fire so I could go and watch movies on my business trips um, and things of that nature. And let me say I, I had a couple of bumps in the road because uh, you know Amazon Kindle Fire only runs MP4. So uh, I go and click on the MP4 and I clicked on MPEG and I converted a movie I wanted to watch. It did in 30 minutes, great. I dragged the movie into the, uh, the USB port to my Amazon Kindle and it wouldn't, it wouldn't run. Um, so that was disappointing. Um, it, the conversion was great and the quality of the video was great. I could watch on my PC and also uh, so I went and troubleshooted and I tried the H.264 format to get it to work on Amazon Fire. Still wouldn't work and it took about two hours to convert the H.264 format over the MPEG-4. Um, so it took quite a bit of time. And, uh, and But what does work is the iPad and tablet um, icon. So you just click on that. If you uh, wanted to put your DVD or movie onto your Kindle, click on the iPad and tablet, and then you go to start, <coughs> and it converts it for you. Awesome. Um, Winx DVD Ripper Platinum, I'm very pleased with this program. Uh, matter of fact, I redid my whole review because this program is, has really impressed me now that I got it to work. I'm really excited about it. And if you're if you're a faculty member or you're a student, um, you have a .edu edu email account, you could get this product for uh, 15 bucks. I spent the extra five to get it, you know, to be able to download it for an extra 24 months. Um, so I highly recommend this program, and you'll see why. Let's look at the quality of some of these pro um, some of these movies that I was able to download. Let's see. All right, this is the MPEG. Opening presentation. This might be choppy as you're watching it, but it's not choppy for me at all. It's very clear, it's very precise. All right, and here's a couple other scenes. The House and the Senate, Senate committee are trying. Try. If I were giving, I were giving out, out grades for daydream, you'd, you'd, you'd be getting an A. A. But in civics, you're, you're failing. failing. You see, you see. Scene. Forget about it. I'm trying to get a scene where they're talking so you guys can match up. Uh, the audio looks pretty good. Psychological pain, but a choosing person. Think I want to become a priest. All right. The audio is pretty good. The quality of the video is pretty good. Not bad. Okay. All right. This is important. Now, um, here's the H.264 format. This one took me two hours to format, and I have a—I don't exactly have an old computer. I have a um, Intel Core 2 Dual 2.14 gigahertz processors, so it should still be pretty acceptable. Presentation still pretty good. <laughs> Now the audio is a little off. I know it's it's not kung fu movie watching off, but it is a little off. Where you going? Where you going? Yeah, it's a little off. We're going to see Notre Dame. You have some friends in the South End? No. Well, there must be some other. Well, there must be some other reasons. 
when you read the announcement when you read the announcement in class, I thought you said anybody could go. I'm sorry. This bus is for students who are interested in it. Actually, no. This audio might be pretty good. So there's an example of uh, of me of ripping the DVD to MP4, um, MPEG, and H.264, and also. Um, on the Amazon Fire or the Kindle Fire. You can uh, you can see that now the video pops up. Now obviously the quality is um, not best since my computer is running much programs right now but the movie looks really good on the Amazon Kindle Fire. I'm very pleased I finally got a program that did what I wanted to do. I highly recommend the WinX DVD Ripper Platinum Excellent program and uh, I believe you'll be very pleased with this product and it's very affordable especially if you're a student um, I believe the retail price is probably like 30 bucks but if you're a student you can get it for half that so you can't beat this um, and I highly recommend it and thank you for for tuning in and I hope I have been a big help to you. And uh, this is Steven Netzker signing off.